Hi guys, this is a video on Windows software. This time I'm talking about how to remove the annoying arrow from shortcuts on the desktop. And you'll find that many of the shortcuts you make will have this arrow. It won't look entirely like this. So I have a picture of um, an XP desktop just grabbed from the internet and you'll notice that the, yours is probably in a black box and it's got a little arrow to it. Now, you can actually remove this so it looks more like programs and not have a little arrow there. Um, it's up to you whether you'd like to do this or not, but you can do this by downloading a power toy from um, from Microsoft. It's called Tweak UI, and it's a very good power toy. This works with uh, Windows XP. Now, Vista users, I think, can have the same functionality by searching for Tweak VI. Uh, I think it's not made by Microsoft; it's made by other people. So you see Tweak UI here. This is uh, quite an invaluable tool, really. So we just go double click and install it. Next, and it's done. Should now be in your start menu. Power Toys for XP, Tweak UI. And you've got a hell of a lot of options here that you can choose from, but I think we're going to go for Explorer and then Shortcut. And you'll notice it says Shortcut Overlay. And uh, this says at the moment the mine's that. Um, or you can change it to None. And then you'll notice that it's not there. Uh, it couldn't do a preview before, I think, because it's already been modified. It hasn't done the little shortcut that's there. You can also add your own custom arrow, I suppose, if you want to. Um, so, <laughs> if you wanted to make a little miniature version of a of a uh, <laughs> question mark right over your icon, if you wanted to, or anything like that, um, that looks a bit cool. But um, either way, this is the way to do it. You just you can choose a light arrow, which is a very tiny arrow, which might be more useful if you want to see more of your icons or you can just select none I think I might have the light arrow, that looks quite good so just click OK and then eventually it will work for a little bit and as you can see now my Firefox has a tiny little arrow attached to it so it's easier to see the icon it's for people who are really fussy and don't like this big icon sticking out so uh, that's about it really. There is another way to do it which is a registry tweak but I've decided not to go into it because it takes um, a lot of backing up and you have to edit um, bitmap files and things like that. So uh, that's about it really. So download the Tweak UI Power Toy and you'll notice that um, in this Power Toy there's a lot more options to customise your Windows XP experience. Uh, it looks like it's disappeared for some reason. But uh, there's things like um, modifying the context menu I think and um, Lots of options, but I can't remember, so I apologise. <laughs> so um, that's about it, really. So thanks for watching my video. This is a very quick and basic trick that you can do to change your shortcut icon from your desktop icons. So thanks for watching my video. Please rate and comment, and thanks again.